dedicated to Lord Krishna, Madam Mohan Temple, is an architectural marvel in the Bishnupur town in West Bengal. It's one of the most beautiful ancient Hindu temples. Built in the year 1695 by King Durjan Singha of Malla dynasty, it's known for its immaculately maintained chariot-style architecture intertwined with stories from Hindu religious books and wall inscriptions engraved from the stories of Ramayana and the Mahabharata. It is definitely a clear symbolization of Bishnupur's great craft in stone and terracotta temples dedicated to various gods and goddesses of Hindu mythology. Purpose of the construction was to honor his family deities Lord Krishna and Radha. Madan Mohan is another name of Lord Krishna. Bishnupur eventually became the capital of the kings of the Malla dynasty. Popular legends circulate around the construction of the temple which believe that the deity Madan Mohan manifested himself on earth to defend the Malla king in the battle with the Maratha invaders, who attacked Bengal. The original temple was destructed in 1820 due to a massive earthquake in the state. The present temple had to be rebuilt after this. Meanwhile, the original deity was installed in a village. As the fame of the deity spread far and wide, a personal visit by Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, the famous Vaishnav saint embarked more value to it. Ekratna style of architecture is used in the making of the temple which reflects the Vishnupur's eternal bond with stone and terracotta temples. Its significant features are square flat roof, curved cornices and a pinnacle top the pictorial representation of Hindu epics and Lord Krishna's adventurers on the pillars is a proof of skilled craftsmanship. The detailed stories seem to come alive in the visitor's imagination. With a square base and a great height, the moderate platform has three arched entrances on its three directions. The sloping roof on four sides is centered with a single shikhar tower. This makes this temple as an Ekaratna temple which houses only one shikhar in its building. The temple is famous because of the legend that includes the deity himself. The king found himself in a life-threatening position against the Marathas that made lost almost all hopes. After hearing the deafening booms of the artilleries, the God-fearing King Gopal Singha woke up from his prostate state. The booming peals of the cannons made the king in convict that God had himself manifested here to protect his kingdom from the invasions of outside forces. The Bishnupur festival is held every year between the 27th and 31st December near the Madnamohana Temple, Bishnupur. The festival celebrates the rich heritage of the town and the temple temple for its beautiful terracotta sculptures and silk saris of great elegance. Bishnupur was once the capital of the Malla kings and is renowned for its crafts since then. The temple of Madan Mohan is a marvel in itself. Its storytelling carvings attract people telling them famous stories especially the big pillars at the entrance recreating the battlefield of the Ramayana. The Eka Ratna style makes the temple special. The terracotta panels that are found in this temple can be considered as the most beautiful among all temples in Bishnupur. The most notable sculpture is Nabnari Kunja where nine females form an elephant. The mandap called as Chandi mandap, along with it, there is a big tree just outside the temple whose trunk has a formation and people have put vermilion on it to give it a face of Lord Ganesh. There are many shops outside the temple selling terracotta items like horses, idols, etc. Madan Mohan Temple is located in center of Bishnupur. As Bishnupur, the important historical town of Bankura district of West Bengal is very well connected with all major cities of India via road, rail and air network. 
Lots of people's visits here throughout the year, which makes Vishnupur more convenient in terms of travel, accommodation and other services. In Fal, Manipur has major airport, which is located just at a distance of around 30 kilometers and Netaji Subhash Chandra Bose in Kolkata is at 140 kilometers from the Bishnupur from where you can get flight to all major cities of India. Bishnupur has major rail junction from where you can get train to almost all part of country. Bishnupur is located at 28 kilometers from Imphal, 135 kilometers from Kolkata, 37 kilometer from Bankura, 64 kilometers from Durgapur, 152 kilometers from Mayapur, 89 kilometers from Belur, 85 kilometers from Tarkeshwar.